Hello, this is Dr. Rinarani Ray. Today, I'll be discussing on the structure of virus. Well, what is virus? Virus are the unique group of infectious agents which infect cells and use their metabolic processes to replicate. They have no metabolic activity outside the host cell and they have to enter host cell to replicate. A complete virus particle or variant consists of one or more molecules of DNA or RNA enclosed in a coat of protein. The nucleic acid content is either RNA or DNA but never the both. The capsid is a protein shell surrounding the nucleic acid. It is made up of many identical protein subunits and they are symmetrically organized. The envelope is a lipid membrane acquired from the host cell, but not all viruses have it. The viral capsid is a storage site for the genome. Capsid is made up of polymeric proteins to conserve genome. So genome plus capsid is nucleocapsid. Virus capsid function in packaging and protecting the viral genes from inactivation by adverse environmental factors and also in attachment of many viruses to specific receptors or host cell. There are three types of capsids in the viral structure, the helical capsid, the complex capsid and icosahedral capsid. Some viruses like chikungunya virus have additional layers that can be very complex and contain carbohydrates, lipids and additional proteins. About 50% of animal viruses have an envelope. It is mostly their lipid bilayer derived from the host cell nuclear or plasma membranes as viral genome does not encode lipid synthetic machinery. One of the largest viruses so far known is a pox virus in 300 nanometer in size. On the other hand, the smallest viruses so far known is a parvoviruses the 20 nanometer in size. Here are some structure and morphology of viruses like tobacco mosaic virus, coronavirus, influenza virus and poliomavirus. We can see the structures of some DNA as well as RNA viruses. Some DNA virus examples are the adenovirus, herpes simplex virus, vaccinia virus, some RNA virus, the polio virus, rio virus, and HIV, that is human immunodeficiency virus. Nucleocapsid inside the envelope may have helical or icosahedral symmetry. The envelope is acquired by budding of nucleocapsid through a cellular membrane. Enveloped viruses are readily infectious only if the envelope is intact. This means that agents that damage the envelope, such as alcohols and detergents, reduce their infectivity. So, this is all about the viral structure. Thank you.